Maryland man has been walking across the country since last year. 9,000 kilometers, what, 5,800 miles? That's a lot of lonely road out there. They lose part of themselves when they go to war. And we just hope that we can help them get all those pieces and parts back together. I don't think we're looked at as patriots or heroes. I think we're looked at as damaged goods. Once you're home, you think it's over. It's just beginning. You go off to war and you're going to be asked to do unspeakable things. To think that you just went over and did your job, that's pretty ignorant. Most people, they look at PTSD and they see weakness. It's a survival mechanism. It's what the situations that we were in over there demanded us to behave in a different way. No one else knows what we went through but them. Not being able to see these guys or not knowing how they're doing, you uh, tend to lose it. It's just, it's hard to communicate. I was very angry very quickly. And I didn't have any control over where my mind was going or what I was thinking about, and I couldn't stop them from happening. When John comes, he carries the grief too, but it's like, I'm not the only one. Like, I can share it with him. These are strong individuals. They're not victims. They're survivors. 